Hello and welcome to today's devotion. My name is Toba and with my wife Abimbala, we are the African Connect Pastors for Audacious Church. This week, we are on a journey through Matthew 28, 16 to 20, the Great Commission, a moment in history where Jesus equipped, empowered and enabled his followers to change the world. Yesterday, we looked at the power of obedience. Uh, today, we look into the call to make disciples. In Matthew 28 19, Jesus gives his final command Go and make disciples of all all nations. This is not just a directive for the ordinary disciples, but for all believers. We are called to carry the gospel into every corner of the world, spreading the hope of salvation. Making disciples isn't limited to preaching or leading large groups. It's about working alongside others in their journey with Christ, encouraging them to grow in faith and helping them to understand God's word. Jesus modeled the this for us during his ministry by investing deeply in the lives of his disciples. Often, we feel inadequate for this calling, but Jesus' words remind us that disciple-making is not about our ability, but about his authority and the presence. In verse 18, Jesus declared, all authority in heaven and on earth has been given to me. <laughs> it's by his power and strength that we can fulfill this mission. God places people in our lives every day who are seeking hope, pur purpose, and truth. Our role is to show them Christ through our actions, words, and love. Whether it's our co-workers, neighbors, or family members, we have the opportunity to impact their spiritual journey. Discipleship also takes time and patience. It's a long-term commitment to helping others grow in their faith. We're not called to simply share the gospel and work away, but to guide, mentor, and encourage others as they learn to follow Christ. As we embrace this calling, Let's remember that we are not alone. Jesus promises to be with us to the very end of the age. With his authority and presence, we are equipped to fulfill his mission. Let us pray. Lord, give me the courage and the love to make disciples. Help us. Help me invest in others and share the hope of the gospel. Remind us that you are with us always, guiding and empowering us. Amen. Love you, church. Join me tomorrow as we continue our journey and look uh, at the authority, looking at the authority of Christ. Bye for now.